Hi, Steve here at the SJC Week Fab Lab, and we're looking at a little bit of coding using AppScript. Now, the concept that we're going to look at is comments. Comments make code, which can sometimes be hard to understand, much easier to understand. It's not actually, arguably, code, since it's not something that the computer understands. It's stuff that we put inside of our code for other people who are going to read and maintain or improve or debug our code. So, let's, let's think about why we want to do that. Well, first off, it is a standard, California Computer Science Standard. Um, in fact, it's 3-5, so it's for students uh, to finish by the time they leave fifth grade. AP 19, describe choices made during program development using code comments, presentations, and demonstrations. Now, there's a few reasons that we want to do this. For one, it helps me in case I forget. It, as you code more and more, you write a lot of code, and you might not remember why you made a variable a specific value at a given time. It also is great because a lot of coding is working with other people. So giving comments helps out everybody. It helps out you, it helps out others. It, it's kind of like taking notes. Uh, it kind of solidifies or, or clarifies something in your own thinking. So let's, let's look at the code that we wrote last time. Notice I have my function, name my function. And I have a number, 0. I add it to that number. Well, let's, let's explain. When I say plus plus, I add 1 to the variable. One more comment. All right, so I've explained what's going on in the code. And now it's not so confusing. There's a little bit of information there to help everyone out. Whenever you write a new function or define a variable, or get something to work that was difficult, it's a great time to go ahead and add in a comment uh, to help yourself out and help out others. Especially if you're maybe going to share this code with students, it can help out to have some comments to help them along. Uh, you can make it so that the, so that the uh, interpreter does not see these words by putting slash slash ahead of them. I can also make a larger comment by going slash star and then ending your comment like that. Anything after this and before this will be commented, even if it's on multiple lines. All right, uh, please go ahead, look at your previous code, and add in some comments to explain why you did what you did.